Listen to what she says. If I had to write a poem about women, I don't think it would do justice to their sex, as that is not what makes a woman excellent. I could take countless hours explaining that women are like snowflakes, because people are like snowflakes and women are people, and people have thoughts, desires, and feelings, just like all women do. But I think that would be wasting my time because you probably wouldn't want to hear it if you didn't think it to be true, even though it is. And all women have something to say and something to add to the conversations that men have and that people have in general. Their voices can be inspirational, doubtful, worried, beautiful, and boring. Just as any voice has different tones and inflections, but most of all, their voices are important. I've lived my life afraid of many of these voices because I've heard them when they were angry or sad, hurt or crying, and I was not in a good place at those times. And I don't think they were either. A voice can be abusive, but it can also be kind, just as a woman can be, as any person can be. And oftentimes what is true of people in general is true of both women and men as well. But the thing that is different from all other voices is that a woman's voice speaks for women, and that's why it's important. But it is important not to speak for somebody else when they can speak for themselves and to encourage all women to do so and listen with an open soul and the expectation in your heart that what you will hear matters because it matters to her.